2.5 million people unemployed, and that figure seems to be rising every day. There's no doubt that the global financial crisis has affected all industries, but I'm here in Clapham, South London, to speak to a man whose profession has perhaps been hit hardest of all, so much so that the ancient craft he specialises in is threatened with extinction. Colin was the youngest ever graduate of the Eager School of Ninjutsu and has been a professional ninja for 15 years. Colin, what made you choose London as a base for your business? An old friend from school had moved to London a few years before. He told me of the strong economy and the ineptitude of the British assassins. Be careful, it's hot. I sensed an opportunity, and sure enough, for the first few years here, I was working constantly. I was offering a service that no one had ever seen before, in a time of great need. England had failed to qualify for the 1994 World Cup finals, and there was much anger in this country. People wanted people killed. I was a young man, but I invested foolishly. Fast cars, fast women, and giant plasma TVs. But alas, like the wind, times change. Colin, how has the current economic climate affected your trade? Uh, there was a time when, if someone had wronged you, you wouldn't think twice about having them assassinated. And with the class and proven track record of the ninja, we were a popular choice. But Colin, the truth of the matter is that people are still being assassinated. <laughs> people are still being killed for money, but not assassinated. For me, paying an Eastern European a small wage just to get the job done does not send a good message. What does send a good message? You may have seen in the James Bond film, You Only Live Twice. The ninjas pour poison down a thin thread into the mouth of Bond's girlfriend as she sleeps. It is truly an art form. But the cost of the correct poisonous ingredients these days doesn't make it financially viable. In my last job, I had to resort to a knife. It's barbaric and messy. It makes me no better than the young kids walking the streets today. Cake. Cake? Please. What would be a typical day for you now? I barely go out these days. If I do, I just get mistaken for a terrorist, or a hoodie, or a Muslim woman. Now, do you not see the importance of maintaining your skills? How do you afford to live in this uh, difficult financial period? My girlfriend works hard every day. I spend most of my day making sure everything is nice and clean for her when she gets back, to show my appreciation. Does she work in a similar industry? Fashion PR. It is difficult. She wants to start a family, which I too want. But the fashion industry is suffering too. Do 
just take your time. Who was it? I am at a crossroad in my life. One path leads to death and honour, the other to shame and my parents' noodle shop. In this current economic climate, it appears that the way of the ninja is fraught with uncertainty. Colin's hopes and dreams, his relationship, and indeed his very soul, are all hanging by a single poisonous thread. Colin had been explaining to me about the way of the ninja and one of his most important skills is the art of invisibility. Uh, in fact, he's so convinced by it that he's actually said that I won't be able to find him in this room now if I have a look. So, let's go search. He is somewhere in here. It's actually uh, pretty amazing. I can't find him in a room that's probably only um, 15 foot by 15 foot. 